What's going on here? You're the one who spoke before the chorus. Maybe you can help. This is not your concern, Outlander. Have we not tolerated enough of your intrusions? I think you can handle one more. What is it? My wife, Kalai. She was to join the chorus. She went up to the promontory to perform the rite of discovery, but she must have fallen. And now they are abandoning the search. We have done enough, Bree. The search party found nothing but her instrument broken beside the riverbed. And atop the promontory was only the dye she used for the ritual. We will not ask more of our people to risk their lives because of one woman's stubbornness. But the seeds she carried deserve to be planted and remembered. I heard how you helped the land god, Ray. How you saw what no one else could. Please, will you look for her seed pouch? False hope is a creeping vine. How is Kalai chosen to join the chorus? The chorus chooses its own, but they can't do so in isolation. They must listen to the people. Kalai was a growing voice for new ideas instead of old traditions, and her beliefs were catching on. We cannot deafen ourselves to dissonance, unpleasant though it might be. So you had to admit Kalai. Or risk legitimizing her ideas even more. The Outlander catches on quick. The Rite of Discovery. What is it exactly? It's a pilgrimage to the Promontory. The place where the first Utaro beheld Plainsong. Kalai was to follow the path our ancestors took. Mark her eyes with dye and then play her song while overlooking the land. She then would have added her mark on the Promontory itself. Joining the marks of those who came before. Every new chorus member used to make the journey. But because of the derangement, the practice has been abandoned. Too dangerous. No one's done it for years. Then why did she do it? We all urged her not to. But, as was her way, she ignored our warnings. She thought it would lend strength to her point of view. She needed to prove that she respected the old ways, even as she advocated against them. Then maybe more people would listen. What were Kalai's political beliefs? Radical. You would have gotten along. Plain song is dying. But Kalai believed we don't have to die with it. As the wind carries the seed to distant lands. She proposed that the Utara leave Plain Song and seek out a new home. We are bound to this land. A tree cannot pick up its roots, even as fire approaches. But you're not trees. It doesn't matter now. Kalai was carrying a pouch of seeds? Every Utara keeps one. We choose the seeds at a young age, taken from the plants of our forebears or those of other significance. And when one passes, their seeds are returned to the land that nourished them, so that life may spring again. Which is why I want Kalai's pouch. Her seeds deserve to be planted in plain song. The river will carry the seeds to new soil, where they will take root and flower. But they won't be at home. It's the best we can hope for. If I'm out that way, I can take a look around. Thank you. The promontory is northeast of here. Look for the broken bridge at the bottom of the cliffs, right at the promontory's base. That's where the search party found her instrument. Okay. That all right with you? How you waste your time is not my concern. Searching for what the land has already reclaimed is fruitless.
Enjoy the quiet while it lasted. Hey! Uh -oh. Who's in there? Sorry, friendly fire. I thought you were a bad guy. Okay, I think that's it. It's forward. Where am I? Oh, wait, no. Didn't mean to do that. I think that machine and shrug off acid. Oh god. We may have to get near. There's the broken bridge. I'm gonna have to take care of these machines before I can look around. For Kalai's seed pouch. I better start at the bridge. Where is the bridge? Can't find it. Oh, wait. Where do I find it? Where are you? Mm. 
Oh, I see. A lot of footprints. Oh, there you go. the search party. Examine the footprints. Marie said this is where they found his wife's instrument. The search party right. concluded Kalai's body was probably carried away by the river. But from up there, that old tree would have caught her. I don't think she actually fell. I should check up at the promontory. Maybe the search party missed something. Ava like is so freaking nice, I swear. So like, That must be the way up to the promontory. Okay, wait, let me figure out how to get up. And I'll talk about why she's so nice. Because, like, she... Ugh. Anyway. She just really helps people. Like, she follows through. Anyway. Let's just climb up. Uh, maybe just follow the. Wait, the way behind this. Anyway, I'm just gonna follow the trail. There must have been another path up. I guess Kalai and the search party climbed the cliff instead. Right here. This seems like the one where I can get up the farthest. Let's go up, up. Farm trailhead. Looks like this is where the rite of discovery started. Hits destroyed. Everything here is so bad. What happened? Oh yeah, they did say that no one's done this for years. I just remembered. Debris on the trail. Oh, it looks like pieces of a bridge. Looks like this fell down here a long time ago. Maybe from a storm. Oh, up here. Got it. To the top, she must have been a good climber. It doesn't yeah. add up that she fell. She, she must be up here contour. somewhere. Looks like Kalai was doing something at that stone table. I should take a look. Okay. Oh, well, don't worry about running out. Get all the berries that we can while we still can. I was playing song. Just like the first Utaru saw it. Flowers, ground into a dye. Kalai must have done this as part of her ritual. I should look around. My focus will help me figure out what happened to her. I think we're gonna go to that cave. Oh, wait, never mind. I spoke too soon. Search party was up here, all right. There's too many tracks to pick out Kalai's. Oh, what's that? Wow, look at Utaru. Looks pretty good. Looks like the edge broke off recently. I still don't think she could have fallen into the river from here. I should keep looking around.
Dude, it is so beautiful. Look at that. And the tires are right there. These flowers have a trace of something on their petals. The dye Kalai was wearing. Looks like it left a trail. Too faint for the search party to have noticed, but my focus can pick it up. There's the dye trail. It looks like it leads away from the cliff edge. The dye trail ends here, with a lot of broken branches. Uh-oh. I should take a closer look. I think we're getting warm, though. Ah, I found the broken branch. Branches were snapped off recently from some kind of struggle. And over here, drag marks. Looks like they lead through this thicket. I can follow them with my focus. the other woman who's that Kalai. those marks on her neck she was strangled <gasps> at least I can return her seat pouch to Bree Who's this one? So the killer must have tried to push Kalai off the cliff. That's why the search party found her instrument by the river. But Kalai fought back. So the killer strangled her. And then dragged her here. Let's go! There. Ooh. Disappeared. So did the music. Oh, there he is. Never mind. Like a one-hit kill. You guys see that? Oh, Stalker's got a friend. 
Oh, okay. At least we're doing Just it. it. Another one. Okay. Ooh, I better it. grab the killer's seed pouch. Might help identify her. <sighs> she die though the killer anyway i love this valor ability melee might is so powerful it just took one hit even on the hardest difficulty i think i can still stack damage even more by doing different builds too so we're gonna do that later on in the game as we go on Okay. Where? Oh, there we go. Oh, the killer sheep. How did the killer die? Maybe Fane and Carol back in Plain Song will know who the seed pouch belongs to. Okay. Whew. Time to bust the link. Is this easy? Wow, this is so cool! Look at the view! It's a good thing we don't have a stamina bar anymore for using our glider. Drum must be part of Cyclops. So if I can get oh. its data, I can reconnect it with the dome back at the base. But how to get up there? Mm. Oops. <laughs> Landed right in the nest of them. Well, do you call this nest or fort? Time to follow up! Huh? No! Missing. Oh, there's a lot of them. <gasps> Let's go, Apex. go we got it okay i'm really curious about this killer like i mean it's time to right no not until i that's glise you found it Bree. Kalai didn't fall she was murdered I went up to the promontory. I found Kalai and the body of the woman who killed her. That's impossible. The search party already checked up there. There was nothing. The bodies were in a separate clearing. Away from where the search party checked. 
A stalker had mauled her while she was trying to hide Kalai's body. Oh, she? okay, that's why she died. Know. I brought back her seed pouch. That belongs to Lina, Kel's apprentice. I don't understand. Why would she do this? Maybe we should ask Kel. But she. You, there. Where is Kel? I saw her leave out the East Gate about an hour ago. She's going home. Summer wind. She's running away? She needs to stand trial. I can catch her. Where is this place? Look for a ruined settlement at our southern border. It's her childhood home. We will get the guards and try to catch up with you. Oh my goodness. I thought Fane was the bad guy there for a second. <gasps> May the land bloom in your steps. Go to summer land. <laughs> she just sneezed so delicately. Anyway, how far is this? Oh, okay. Kel, you got some splaining to do. What's she holding? So now everyone knows. It was only a matter of time once you went up that cliff. You stood right next to the man whose wife you had murdered and told him to move on. I never wanted any of this to happen. Then why? Calais sowed the seeds of discord. She wanted the Utaru to leave Plainsong, abandon our home. If that thought caught on, it would have been more destructive than any sickness or machine. So you had her killed? There was a natural order to all things. She poisoned Growth, herself. Decay. Death. It's the way of the world. A tree cannot pick up its roots, so I stopped what was threatening us. And I'm sorry it came to it, but it's over now. I'm gonna make sure you pay for all the suffering you've caused. Too late. Let's just, uh, let's say you still failed. Let's, uh, because I have no heart for this woman at all. <laughs> you think you stopped Kalai's beliefs from spreading? But when people hear what you did, they'll cast aside the old ways even more. No. And you won't be around to do anything about it. Mm-hmm. No! She needed to stand trial! Kalai deserves justice. Kel thought that silencing Kalai would silence her beliefs. Prove her wrong. That will give Kalai justice. It isn't much, but I want you to have this. He calmed down so quick! I won't have to spend the rest of my days wondering what happened to Kalai. Blighted Aww. are the leaves. Three of our people dead. And for what? I admit it. I never wanted you among us. But now, it seems I must thank you for revealing the rot that had taken hold here. I'm sorry it had to happen this way. Fane's a good guy? At least with the rot removed, new growth can thrive. I don't buy it. I feel like... Fane's a bit of a bad guy. I don't know. I don't know. He gives off that aura a bit. I'll make sure Kel's body is properly seen to. Kel's treachery will be a shock to many in Plainsong. I'll plant Kali's seed pouch in Plainsong. You made that possible. Kel would have gotten away with murder. 
If not for you, Aloy. You've done enough for us, Outland. Go while the roots are strong. Can't believe he has a nice guy all the time. Exposed Kel's treachery. I'll plant Kali's seed pouch in plain song. I'll make Sorry, sure I just did an Elden Ring where we exhausted the conversation and just made sure we didn't miss anything. Can't believe Fane is a good guy, though. Hmm. I'm skeptical. 